I'ma crack now, sit your ass down. I got stuff I never had now. I could brag now. Yeah, my niggas they gon' spread. You try to rip it packs, wasting money, not getting anything in return. Well, visit BobMuckCoins.com and use promo code JMail for 10% off to get the God Squad you always wanted. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy JMail Flow, aka Mr. Let's Get It, Let's Go. Bringing y'all, y'all like, hey, JMail, JMail. Where's the post patch here? You don't post blitzes no more. The reason why I did not really post some blitzes is because every blitz that are really out there in the community, I have already uploaded on my channel. So. Like there's no more there wasn't really more heat to upload but there was different versions of heat you can upload so i'm that's what i'm about to show y'all right here here you go i don't know if y'all ready i don't know if y'all ready uh where we go so the first one is either the nickel normal or the nickel 245 even i think it's even in the nickel 335 sam i'm not sure but it is called the nickel blitz 2 y'all like yo you already uploaded this blitz no 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 oh, we got some streamers out here but like like i said be sure to like comment subscribe if you're new to the channel check out my other videos tips and trick gameplays for y'all like i said i don't know whose blitz this is i just know everyone runs it in madden 17 there is no really oh this is his blitz this is like yeah there's no really unique blitzes everybody runs the same thing basically so i'm this isn't my blitz i don't know whose it is i just know the setup so i'm gonna upload the freaking setup for y'all you know what i'm saying so here goes the nickel blitz 2 here we go bro so i'm gonna show you how to how do you exactly how do you supposed to run this so y'all like yo how, how are you supposed to run it you know talk to me talk to me so first thing you want to do is baseline press pinch your d line and then you're gonna crash to the outside you're gonna hit lb up or l1 and up on the right sticks and now they crash outside then you're gonna shift your linebackers to the right and then usually this is the setup right here and then you, usually you can uh cross man this guy right there or you can sub in a linebacker right here like you see michael smith is there you can cross man him like even if you got someone like khalil mack i'm not sure you can sub a linebacker in right there i, I think you can only sub a left in in right here but like i said put somebody like mack there khalil mack a right in boom they are going to do is hover over that middle spot and you see him come screaming this comes in with a running back block same side like i'm this is one of the most glitchiest blitzes out there that's only the first setup so the next next setup baseline press pinch your d line crash outside shift your linebacker to the right so baseline press pinch your d line crash to the outside shift your linebacker to the right the next setup the screamer like when they don't expect this all you want to do is hit rb Reblitz that right outside linebacker RB right in the right stick, or you can click on to him and reblitz him. Come hover right here. We just gonna block everybody just to show y'all. All you wanna do is hover right here in the center, or you can come and hover right here. It's really up to y'all. I like to hover in the center, but it's up to you. Whole RT to stand right there, and boom, you see him come in with a running back block. You usually get double edge heat uh, depending on how to play it. So, so we gonna like I said, this is the new setup. Y'all don't believe me? Go to Twitch. Uh, AKG runs this. I let me name a couple people on top of my head. We got AKG ran it. The reason uh, then Pony ran it against me nearly. If y'all watch my streams, Pony nearly destroyed me with this blitz. Almost the first game we played, I didn't know how to block it. I did not know how to block nickel blitz. But I, I knew how to block the basic version, like this way, baseline press. Then uh, like anyone could block this way. Like oh, okay, he's cross man. Uh, like this way, that that was like that was simple to block. You know what I'm saying? But that's what Pony was doing to me. But basically, that's how most people run nickel blitz, and they don't know like about this way. So baseline press. Pinch your D-line, crash your D-line to the outside, shift your linebacker to the right. You don't have to, like I said, you want to mix it up. Like, if you, you can blitz from the right, and then, like, you can cross man this guy right there. Boom, do that. Like, you can send pressure from both sides, and that's why this blitz is so good. By that time, y'all see it get picked up. But like I said, pressure, you can send it from both sides, left or right. And one person I know who uses to perfection was True Boy. If y'all don't know True Boy, he played in Madden Classic. He literally uses to perfection, like... Like you can like 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 the whole field looks symmetrical. Like y'all see like he, no one knew what pre side pressure was coming from. He hovered in the middle. You got three people to the right, three people to the left. Sometimes he would uh, pit these guys in coverage. He'd do something like this. I, that's not what he'd do. But then sometimes uh, he would do something like this. Like you know what I'm saying? He he a cross man that guy there. Boom, and then he'd do that. Like you never knew what side pressure was coming from with this dude. And that's why like I think that's the person who really show you can send blitz from both sides but this blitz has been out for a while so i'm not saying like oh he's the one that came up with it like i said this and then right here i usually send on third and long like when they don't expect like you see you get double edgy and that's basically how the, that's the new setup for nigga blitz but like i said you really need to lab this you need to get used to making adjustments from both sides like if you're gonna want to make adjustments uh like i said you got to get used to doing that motion because like sometimes you like once you get really good at sending pressure from both sides uh then you then that's when you really uh 
then that's when you realize we're we gonna block a running back but like well, like i said once you get used to sending pressure from both sides then that's when you really are gonna get good at Madden because a lot of people come out and only keep sending from the same side it gets easy to pick up but when they don't know what side you're sending it from oh my like it can really it can really get nasty like and then you can send it from both oh my god like this blitz is just amazing y'all i'm telling y'all like i said check this blitz out like comment subscribe if you're new to the channel make sure you lab it go to twitch if you want to see these people run this blitz to perfection make sure you cross man and making adjustments and make sure you send it from the right sometimes and send it from the left and then you want to surprise them when sending it from both sides but that's really the setup i hope y'all enjoyed this video like comment subscribe but until then it's your boy J Mail flow aka mr let's get it let's go